Hey there, welcome back to my affordable garage makeover. Now, an essential part of any garage makeover, you spend all this time, not too much money on this makeover, to get your garage the way you want it, and you need to have a place to put all your junk. Or maybe it's not junk, maybe it's future mods for your car. But whatever it is, you need a place to put it. Now you can go the expensive route and get a real nice cabinet system, or you can keep it affordable and go with a shelving system. Now I went with the Yahi Tech shelving system from Amazon. This is only $55 a set. I've got three sets that I'm going to be using. Each set can build a five foot tall shelving system or you can break it up into several different units and I'll show you that later. Okay, they don't really recommend that you have to have any tools for this but I suggest you have a nice rubber mallet and a buddy. Today, my buddy here, here he comes, he's having a hard time. This is my brother-in-law, Dale. He's gonna help me today get this thing together. So I'll do a little time lapse of us putting it together, and then we'll show you when it's in place and when it's done. It's pretty easy. It all just clips together, with all these little parts and so forth. Like I said, you don't need a tool. You don't need any screwdrivers or wrenches, but if you have a rubber mallet, it kind of saves your hand a little bit from when you gotta force things into place. Okay, let's get to building this thing. take too long did it? It only took uh, about 45 minutes to get the whole thing done. As you can see, it's about six feet high. Five shelves, six feet high. Right now it's on sale for $55 on Amazon, normally it's $69. I'll have a link in the description and also pinned in the top of the comment section. Now you can do this in several different configurations. I've used three different configurations here. Over here I've used a side-by-side -side configuration. Gives you about three feet high. You put them side by side like this, it gives you a nice little workspace here that you can I can use to work on for different variations. I mean, I've been using the top of my toolbox. That's a real good workspace, but this is gonna be a little longer. So if I'm doing a splitter or something on here, I can spread it out on them there. And then over here on this side, we've got them split with a table in the middle. It's kind of my wife's size, side. That's her little craft table she's gonna work on. And I just went on Amazon, got a little uh, trade show cover for it. I'll put a link in the description down below for that too. So all this wall areas are going to be covered up with some nice artwork. I'll be doing that in a couple days and then the job will be done. Remember there will be a link to all these products 
in the description below at the top of the comment section next week i'll be doing all the artwork until then i'm tim see ya